Ziad, welcome to Queen's Park Rangers. Firstly, importantly, how do we pronounce your full name? Uh, it's quite easy. It's uh, Ziad. Ziad. And, uh, and your surname? Larkesh. Ziad Larkesh. Ziad, you've agreed a three-year deal here with QPR. How pleased are you to join the club? No, I'm really pleased. Um, really excited for this new challenge and uh, this new opportunity. And uh, yeah, just want to start to I meet some of the boys and uh, ready to be on the pitch and uh, express myself. Excellent. And you grew up at Paris, Paris Saint-Germain and you were there for nine years. How did your time there help you to develop as a player? Obviously, like the era of Paris, there is many good players. I met many good players and uh, even today I have like some of them, they're still my friends. And um, obviously it helped me to develop because it's such a competitive environment. So I think I learned a lot. It's helped me to develop as a, a player, but um, also as a teenager when I was there. So it was lots of experience. I traveled around the world and I played different type of football. So it was really, had really good time there. And you joined Fulham in the summer of 2020, moving to London at the age of just 17. How did you find that experience? Yeah, at the beginning, it was, like you said, the first time. So to leave the family, my brothers, my sisters, it was not that easy, obviously, the parent. But I think it was the, the right time for me to go. Um, it helped me even more to develop. Uh, I was like a young man and uh, now to live by myself and in a new country to learn a new language, to learn a new culture. Uh, I really like it and uh, I feel really comfortable now here in England. So, yeah, it was really good. And does that show how committed you are to your football, to making it as a footballer, to progressing in your career, that at 17 you decided to move countries for that? Yeah, I think, like, I don't want at the end of my career, my career to have any regret. So, like, when I think it's the right opportunity, I don't hesitate a lot. I, I speak with my parents, with my agents, and after, like, I like challenges. So, yeah, I think it was the right time for me to go. And last season, you spent a season on loan at Barnsley. You made 23 appearances, helping them finish in the playoffs in League One. How beneficial was that experience, playing regular football? I think it was a great experience for my development to be like around the first team around, uh, first team environment, sorry. And um, obviously, I had like two seasons with the under-23 at Fulham and I wanted the step. So it was good. Um, I think we did like a great season Unfortunately, we didn't manage to be promoted, but obviously, like for first team experience, mm, like it was, it was good. Now, is the is the next step, and it's for that I'm happy to to be here. People always talk about football in England is very physical. How did you find that change, that transition, particularly last season? Mm, I agree. Like obviously, League One days, some game is like really physical, like you said. But on the other hand, you can also play football. Like, I think you need to find a good balance. And uh, now I find that exciting, this physical aspect. And after, I can also, so, also show sorry, my technical ability. So I have no issue with that at all. Why were you keen on this move to QPR? I think it's a great move. It's a great club, uh, great history, obviously. And uh, in London, and um, I think for my development, uh, I spoke with the manager. I think it was something really important for me before to coming here. I had really good discussion with him. And uh, obviously now to be in the championship and um, to sign like a, a deal three years with such a good club, I think for me it was the, the right step. So I'm really happy. You say you spoke with Gareth Ainsworth. What did he say to you? No, he said he liked me as a player. He think uh, I'm a really attacking um, left back or, or wing back. And... Uh, he likes the risk I can take, also like my 1v1 defending. And I, I, during our discussion, I could tell that he analysed my game, everything. So that was something important. And uh, now we had a, a really good discussion and uh, that helped me to, to decide because obviously I had like different options in UK and even uh, across Europe. So that's helped me to decide to, to join this club. Tell us about your strengths. Uh, I think like... Uh, I, I try to attack, uh, attack a lot. Uh, if I can score, deliver assist, uh, I will be really happy is what I want to do. But also, um, I like also to defend, to win challenges. And uh, 
I try to run a lot, to be fair, like during the game, I'm not someone who is really tired, so I can do the effort for, for the team. And um, yeah, if I can provide assist and goal is what I, I particularly like. Gareth Ainsworth has also said that the players at this club for the coming season, he said he wants players that are committed, give everything, run all day like he did as a player. And that's something QPR fans and Gareth Ainsworth can expect from you. Yeah, and that's something he told me. And uh, I said to him during our discussion, we are on the same page and uh, is what I like. I, I like, I think, uh, if, I white from, if I fight for one of my teammates, I want him to do the same for me. And I think it's like that we have success. So something really important. And uh, I think it's the mentality that I like to be uh, in the changing room and in a team. So I think for that, there will be like no issue and uh, we're perfectly on the same page. Excellent. And just finally, how much are you looking forward to playing in front of the QPR fans at Loftus Road? Yeah, that's something like I'm really excited to now it's pre-season. I think uh, we're going to go to a tour in Austria. But obviously, like, I think that's the most important thing in football, like uh, the fans to, 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 to give joy to the fan and to be with them. Like I think it's something like I'm really excited about. Best of luck. Thank you very much.